The spectators showed up to see the final round of the John Deere Classic on Sunday. One family there held a special place with a special golfer. Local force Tara Rahman joins us in the studio with the family's connection to this year's champion. Tara? Jim, it all started with Matt Solis, who played golf in college with Dylan Fratelli's backup caddy. When Matt offered up the family home for tournament week, none of them knew just how memorable it would become. And from South Africa, Dylan Fratelli. There's a lot that goes into the making of a champion. You play golf, you play well, you earn what you get and no one can take that away from you. And for the champion of the 2019 John Deere Classic, that includes one Coal Valley family. My backup caddy actually knew a family in town, the Solis family, and he said, you can go stay with them if you want to, and I always prefer that to stay in a home, stay with people, because hotel rooms get really boring. Jim and Sherilyn Solis had hosted their son's golf friends before, but Matt says this time was different. This felt a lot different because I knew he was good enough to win. We knew Dylan was a special golfer. For a week, the family says they learned a lot living with Dylan Fratelli. How they calmed themselves down on the, on the golf course and stuff like that. It was interesting. Including eating habits. He took us up a couple of times, but then he liked to stay a lot healthier than we usually are. So. Although, although he did like his Whitey's ice cream, they gave him a few cups. He brought a bunch of them back to the house, put them in the freezer. And as the rounds racked up, yeah. so did the family's emotions. He seemed really calm out there and didn't seem nervous. So I think we were probably more nervous than he was coming down the stretch. So. Matt hopes his family helped with the player's state of mind. We kind of just let him do his own thing, and he had plenty of time to relax and get away from it all off the golf course, and I think that really helped. In the end, it was a special win for the Solaces. We kind of considered our adoptive son while he was here, and we just got excited for him. And they hope this is just the beginning of a new friendship with Fratelli. <laughs> The Solis family is now rooting for Dylan Fratelli to make it to the BMW Championship. They hope to travel to Medina, Illinois to watch him play there in August. In the studio, Tahira Rahman, Local 4 News. Nice story, Tahira. Thank you.